one week after we carved the toe out, started her on antibiotics again, and um, uh, poulticed, um, all that kind of stuff. And uh, as you can see, that fetlock and cannon bone area, that's uh, no swelling, not much anymore, standing on it. Uh, let's see how she walks, but I'm going to take this off. I've been changing that thing every other day now since then and she's been on antibiotics every day since then so let's see how she walks that's not too bad certainly better than it was so I'll take that thing off and show you what it's like underneath See if this hay bag distracts her a little bit. She's got all her weight on it right now. See the other side is cocked, so can't be hurting her too much. But you can see right in here where it it's all split out. That's why I got a trimmer. One of the reasons. So that abscess probably came right in there where that crack is. Worked its way all the way up through here. Originally came out right up there. Then it kind of disappeared for a little while. I went to the heel bulb, came out there for a while. And then after I thought everything was going along fine, it came out right here. So it's been traveling. I'm telling you, I haven't seen anything quite like this. Hard to see in there. That's probably an inch. That's where it was draining from. I think this was the original cause of the asthma. Was uh, asthma? Yeah. The original cause of the abscess is this toe crack here, and then it just kind of meandered through the the hoof and came out the coronary band, this side and the other side, and out the heel bulb. So uh, I haven't really been able to trim her up much because you know, she's real, she was sensitive there. So I might take a rasp it today and bring it down a little bit. This side is obviously higher than that side. But. So I'm going to go real slow here using the fine side of my rasp here just so you let her get the feel of it. Because I don't want her to start jack jackhammering on me. Then I'll work my right way around to my near side here. Feel her out here. This side is way high. Try this side. I gonna do this last week. Not without tranquilizer anyway. Well, 
easy. That's it. Watch out, get too carried away here. Easy, easy. Just want to take what I can get without getting kicked here. Okay, 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 all right. Okay, all right. No, 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 no. Easy. Come here. All right, take a break. Take a break. I got rid of a lot of that false sole that was on there. Both sides. Trim the bars up a little bit. There's still more there, but she's not letting me uh, do too much. So I'll just take this for what I have now, and uh, a couple days I'll try it again. So I'll take this gauze here and saturate it with sugar dime and stuff it in that crack. She didn't like it before. So when I put it on, if she puts her foot down, hopefully it lands on the towel here. Good girl. Whoa. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Not so bad this time. Okay. No, 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 no. Come on. Come on. Give me a foot. Good girl. these heels open for the moment so I get a poultice going for those too. Okay, all right. Good girl. She knows I'm trying to help her. Right, Jody? I am. <laughs> 